here we are everybody amazon.com what we're doing is you can see that it closed uh, right in here they're going to report the qu quarterly earnings are going to come out anytime and what we're looking for is selling short up right below 320 and buying a dip down at 175 there it is 298 by there there it is 296 I'm going to pull up a one minute chart I'm out to buy this limit order at $175 if Amazon was already overbought I'm sorry $275 $275 is where the limit order will be please hold on one minute the stock is tanking very nicely this is what we were looking for I'm gonna get the headline number we're gonna buy the dip do I have a number yet nope I do not have a number MMTs I can tell you one thing it's live it's here it's right now this stock they ran it parabolically up I don't have a report but you can see where the low is I'm going to show you right here where the Amazon is printing over here with the one minute chart and after hours now here's the key we hit 287 look at that big big red bar come down so we're starting to bounce off of there at that 286 yeah we are 290 are they gonna take it back up that was a nice drop we're gonna get hit we got hit on a couple hundred chairs nothing big it's how to buy that dip and we're ripping right now it's ripping right back up at 292 I'm gonna be selling it as it comes up this is live in after hours we will do another trade on it okay so I'm getting a headline number Amazon actually believe this or not the preliminary number was minus two cents versus being positive five cents revenues were 15.7 billion versus the 15 point seven four billion so the revs are in line and we're selling it right here right now because I don't like how that knee jerked down we got hit the thing about it is it's time to sell MMT go ahead sell into it right now sell right up there right into it you're out that's the after hours chart I'm gonna do another live video with the MMTs I got to find more about the operating income with 79 million versus negative 340 million that's that 10 million guidance and estimates of 62 million the CQ3 operating income well that's minus it was minus 444 million now it's only minus 65 million estimates at 83 million on that now I'll have to get down into it Q3 revs of 15.4 to 17.15 versus 16.98 so that's why we're getting that nice little bounce but the thing about it is is we are going to have to do what get on the conference call get another limit order down below the marketplace this is that knee-jerk opening bell for the earnings after the close and we will update it as to where we're at right now 386 on the low printing 292 by 295 and there will be a lot that we have to go over in the quarterly earnings and the conference call when that happens in an hour from now